What's up, boys and girls? It is an exciting video today because we are watching the new trailer for Thor, and I, I've been expecting this trailer, and I've been waiting for it, and honestly, I'm surprised it took them this long to put it out. The movie is only, I think it's coming out in July, so for them to not be teasing trailers for, like, almost an entire year is kind of crazy, especially for such a highly anticipated movie because we're getting Thor, but it's going to have Guardians of the Galaxy in it because last we saw Thor, he left with them. So for such a huge movie in the Marvel franchise, as well as this, I want to say this is like one of the next big ones in this section of the MCU because in this chapter so far, we've gotten a lot of new Marvel movies and not a lot of continuation ones other than we've got Spider-Man, which already came out crazy. Doctor Strange is coming out, which is another big one. And then it would be this would be the next one. So the fact that they didn't put out like 12 teaser trailers already is crazy. But let's just go into it because I'm so excited. So let's see how it goes. Well, right into we go. Right into it. Oh my goodness. I love it. Is he still going to be Big Thor or is he back into shape? <laughs> Exactly who I am. Also, are they gonna give us any Loki? Like, I don't know how that's gonna work. Yeah, he's getting back into shape. <laughs> oh my god, so extra. My superhero days are over. Good song. Ooh, okay, okay. Remember what I told you. Oh, I love him too. Welcome to Asgard. Just look into the eyes of the people that you love. <laughs> Not me. What? Just listening. <laughs> Bruce Gamora. Why is Gamora? Wait, is that? <gasps> oh, damn. Oh, damn. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. So, yeah, I, I like this top card. First MCU character to get a fourth movie. I didn't think about that, but heck yeah, dude. And honestly, after his last one was Ragnarok, and honestly, Ragnarok, I'm not a huge Thor person, and I didn't fall in love with Thor until I want to say like second Avengers slash Ragnarok, which Ragnarok felt like an Avengers movie. And then I really, really fell in love with his character and his everything. Like, I like his lore, and I love Lo Loki's, like, my favorite villain, whatever you want to consider him. And I'm so excited for this movie. It looks good. Like, I love all the Guardians of the Galaxy members, so... We also have so much explaining to do that we haven't gotten yet. We've, like, we've got Spider-Man and Doctor Strange, and we got that half of, you know, post-Infinity War and Endgame. But we haven't gotten this half. We don't know what's going on with Thor. With Loki, we did get the Loki series. So we have that. But it like kind of cancels out what happens in Endgame. So I'm not totally sure what's going to happen with Loki. Or if we would have him in this movie at all. Or if they're going to explain that. And then on top of that, we don't know what's happening with any of the Guardians of the Galaxy. And like, there's all the weird stuff that happens with Gamora. And then she's back. And then it's... I'm curious to see how they not only wrap up all of that a little bit more, but what's going forward. What is the next storyline for all of them? Because now that there's no, like, Thanos, it's back to, like, smaller enemies until they end up telling us who the next, like, big dog is going to be. Because they've honestly set the stage for several big dogs to be the next, like, huge villain. And I'm not sure who exactly it is it's going to be yet or who they're going to focus on being that one big person that'll be like this next section of who everyone's gonna accumulatively come together to face so i feel like this movie coupled with doctor strange just next month is going to give us so 
much more information. I am so incredibly excited. Beginning of July, July 8th, this is coming out. So literally, we've got so many good movies, guys. We have just this week, I saw Fantastic Beasts. In a couple weeks, we have Doctor Strange. Then we have Jurassic Park. Then we have Thor. Ugh. I'm excited for everything that's to come in cinema in general and especially in Marvel for this year. So that's my opinion. I'm excited. Let me know if you're excited. What are you excited about? Are you a fan of Thor? If not, who is your favorite Avenger? Comment down down below. And who is your favorite MCU character that they have that's currently active, I guess I'll say. I'm just, I'm just curious. I'm just curious. But that's all I've got for today. I hope you guys were as excited about this as I was. I did catch pictures and snippets of this earlier, so not all of it was a complete surprise because the internet ruined it very quickly this morning, like the second I woke up. But I am just, I'm excited for this. So I'm going to leave it at that. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you like my reactions to videos and reviews and breakdowns and stuff, let me know. I love doing these and I love meeting more of you guys. Until the next video though, bye guys!